today's video, we are doing a underwater mob battle against my best friend, Cam. But what Cam doesn't know is that I am secretly cheating by using this one-way glass. Meaning I could see whatever mob he places down on his side and I will have the exact counter to it. This is going to be awesome. All right, Cam, are you ready for this underwater mob battle? I am so ready and there's no way you're going to be able to defeat my mobs. I wouldn't be so sure, but let's just pick our side. I'm picking orange because it's the best color. Well, I'm picking light blue because I already know it's the best color and it's already got more coral than you do. All right, well, let's just go ahead and start round one. All right, I'm definitely gonna win, let's go. All right, it is time for round one. And now all we have to do is just look through this one way glass to see what Cam is going to place down. Oh my gosh, ew, what are those? Are those like blobfish or something? Oh, and he's placing down a lot. I'm gonna have to think of something really strong to counter these. And I think I have the perfect idea. If we go into the creative menu, we can look up eater and get the eater of the depths. And honestly, look at this thing. It is super scary and super loud. Cam's blobfish will be no match for this. So I'm just gonna place down maybe like five of these. And because Cam was just gloating about it earlier, I say we go invis, go over to his side and break his coral. So let me just open up my creative menu and get a invisibility potion. That way Cam can't see me cheating and going over to his side. There we go. I'm completely invisible. And if we just fly right over to his tank, we could be over here with the blobfish. And now we just need to break his coral. Honestly, my side is coming along greatly. I have all my blobfish ready to fight and I have my coral, which is sort of like my throne. It's kind of funny. Wait, what's happening to my coral? No, why is it getting broken? Oh my gosh, who broke my coral? And I think time is up and we can start round one. So Cam, are you ready for the first round? Uh, uh, yeah, but somebody broke all of my coral, so I don't know what happened to it. I miss it already. Was coral like the mob that you placed down? No, it was my blocks of coral. I just miss it. Well, you could remake that. Let's just get our mobs ready and take down this wall. All right, Cam, I'm going to get rid of this wall in three, two, one. Say hello to my army of eaters of the depths. Oh, my. My gosh, what is that? That's so scary. Come on, Blobfish, do something. You picked Blobfish? Blobfish don't do any damage. I didn't know that. They look super scary, but they're also kind of cute. My eaters of the depths are just living up to their name. They're eating all of your blobfish. Oh my god! Look, I think I that's think the last one right just there. The last one. Yeah, your army was no match for the eaters of the depths right here. They are the best underwater mob. What do you mean? My mobs are still alive. Come up to the top. They're just floating. I don't think that they're still alive, Cam. Look, they're still in the water and they're playing. Let's go. I win. Yeah. No, I think I won this round. Fine, let's clean up the arena and go on to round two. All right. And now that it is time for round two, I cannot believe that Cam picked stupid blobfish for the first round. Let's just look through the one-way glass and see what he picks for the second round. Hopefully it's nothing too strong. What? Lobsters? I don't even think lobsters do any damage. They have claws, but I don't think I've ever been hit by a lobster. Oh my gosh, and he's spawning so many of them. He has an entire lobster army. Okay, I have the perfect counter. Let's just go into our creative menu and look up whale and here we go. I can't even say that. It's the, the catch a lot whale. I think that's how you say it. And look at how giant this thing is. It takes up almost the entire arena, but honestly, it looks really cool. So we're gonna spawn in a couple of these guys and hopefully they like eating lobsters. Unfortunately, there's no butter guys. All right, and now that we have all of these whales placed and they look super cool, I wanna go over to Cam's side and get rid of some of those lobsters because there are so many. And wait, Cam, are you sitting on a throne? Wait, how do you know I'm sitting on a throne? I, I just took a guess, but like, what is that made out of? Is that coral? You are definitely cheating because I don't know how you've seen that, but yeah, I am sitting on my coral throne and my army is ready and they are super strong. Oh my gosh, his army is ready. Okay, I need to go and take out some of those lobsters. So let's just grab another potion of invisibility and go right over to Cam's side and just get rid of some of the lobsters while he's not looking, just like this one right here and that one, and he can't even see it because he's looking over his throne. Get rid of that one and that one. Wait, I hear some lobsters dying. Wait, what's going on? No, they're tails. Some lobsters are being killed. What happened? No. Wait, your lobsters are dying? Yeah, they're being killed by something. I don't know what's happening. 
Are you sure lobsters are ocean creatures? Well, where else are you supposed to find lobsters? They only come in the ocean. All right, we're, I think I'm just going to take out these two lobsters and then I'm going to go back to my side. That way Cam doesn't know that it was me. Oh my gosh, hopefully these lobsters over here are fine. All right, they all seem fine and healthy. All right, and now with my whale army ready and Cam's lobster army a little bit gone, I think that time is up. So Cam... Are you ready for round two? I'm ready, but hopefully my lobsters just don't die in the battle. Hopefully they're all very healthy and very strong. All right. Well, I think it's time that we get rid of this wall. So I'm bringing it down in three, two, one. Say hi to my army of whales. Oh my gosh, they're super scary. And look, they're going down to your lobsters. Oh my gosh. Wait, Nick, where are you? Oh, I'm I'm above the water. Well, I don't see you. Oh my gosh, I forgot to get rid of my invisibility. Okay, let me just drink some milk real quick and go above the water like I said I was. Cam, I'm up here. Do you not see me? Oh, I see you now, Nick. You scared me. I thought you ran off. No, why would I want to miss my whales absolutely eat your lobsters? Oh my gosh, Nick, there's only three lobsters left and they're circling the last few this sucks yeah my whales are completely demolishing your lobsters why did you think lobsters were a good idea well they've got claws and they hurt so i thought they would do a lot of damage but whales are pretty strong and i don't think lobsters can pierce their skin oh look that whale just got that one Oh my gosh, Cam, there's only one lobster left. Yeah, and he seems to just trying to be running away to blend in with your side. So I think you win this time, but I'm definitely going to win next round. Let's just get rid of this stupid lobster off of my side. I thought you would like him because he's orange. Lobsters are red. He's blending in pretty well with your orange. I think you might be colorblind. All right, well, let's reset the arena and get ready for round three, which I'm definitely going to win. No, I definitely am going to win this. Well, all my lobsters may have been defeated last round, Nick, but at least I still have my throne and I know exactly what mob I'm going to use against you this time. Well, that's a good thing because I know exactly what mob I'm going to use against you this time, and I will rightfully claim my throne, except I'm going to make it orange. Why would you make it a bad orange color and leave it light blue, the better color? Because orange is the better color. I don't know about that, but I'm ready to start round three. Let's go. Okay, now we just need to wait to see what mob Cam places down and... Are those cod? Like from normal Minecraft, just regular cod. Does Cam not know that they don't do damage? He's doing this again, just like with the blobfish. Okay, well, I think we need to teach him a lesson this time and go with a mob that is super overpowered. If we go into our creative menu, we can look up an orca. It's another whale. So we're going with two whales in a row and we just place it down and look at it. This whale definitely would like to eat some cod right now. So I'm just gonna place down an entire family of them. And we even have a baby one. So I'm gonna make sure that Cam's COD army is no match for these orcas. And he's gonna actually pick a mob that is semi-decent. But now I wanna go troll Cam by making his throne orange because he keeps making fun of my favorite color. So if we just grab some of this orange coral and grab a invisibility potion. I also can't forget milk this time because I actually forgot to go uninvis last time and Cam almost caught me. We could just turn on our invisibility and wait for Cam to be distracted so I can make his throne orange so if we just fly over to cam's side we have to wait for him to be distracted so we can make this throne orange oh my gosh my cod are so ready and they are forming a tiny little groups and they are definitely gonna win against whatever mob nick places down and look they look so awesome all right now that he's distracted i could just turn his entire throne orange the better color so let me just do this and replace the entire thing with orange coral. And Cam will be so upset. And now I'm just gonna run away and get back to my side like nothing ever happened. And look, the orcas are jumping out of the water. They're so excited for the color orange. Oh my gosh, what happened to my coral throne? What happened to it? Why is it this yucky orange? I think your coral just evolved from blue to like a better color. No, there, it would de-evolve then because light blue is such a better color than orange. Everybody knows that. I'm not sure, but are you ready for the next round, Cam? I am so ready and I'm so gonna win. All right, before we take down the wall, I actually have to get rid of my invisibility. I didn't forget this time. And now we are ready for round three. Orca army, are you ready? Oh, look, they're jumping out of the water. They are so ready. All right, Cam, I'm going to get rid of the wall in three, two, one. And here is my army of orcas. 
Oh, and look, they're getting rid of your stupid cod army. Oh my gosh, they're whipping my cod with their tails. I didn't know they could do that. That's so cool. Look, they're doing special air attacks. They're jumping. Oh my gosh, that's super cool. But my cod are definitely going to win. Hurry, come on, cod. Cam, are you sure your cod can even attack? I think so. I think they got teeth. Yeah, it doesn't look like they're doing any damage to my orcas. And my orcas are just diving from the air. Oh my gosh, this has to be rigged. Uh, Maybe you should have just picked a better mob. And there's little baby orcas as well helping. This is so unfair. Oh my gosh, Nick, I am down to my last few cod, but hopefully they can pull this in and win this for me. I can't tell the difference between the cod that are still alive and the cod that are just floating at the top. Come on, orcas, do your special air attack. Oh, there it goes. It is completely annihilating your army, Cam. Your orcas are doing a lot of damage, and my cod aren't doing anything, so I think you put them on some sort of spell. I didn't do anything to your cod. The only thing I did was just made friends with some orcas. And look, this is your last couple of fish. Oh, the baby's even joining in. Oh, and this is your last cod right here. No, I've got two left. Oh, I didn't see that one. No! And oh there God. is round three of my orcas coming on top. Before we start the next round, I got to get rid of this yucky orange throne so I can replace it with something better next round. But are you ready for round four? I think you should have kept the orange. No, I like light blue personally, but orange is still a stupid color. But I think it's time for round four. All right, let's just clear the arena and say goodbye to the orcas and get ready for round four. All right, now it is time for round four. I can't believe that the orcas were so overpowered, but now let's just look through this one-way glass and see what mob Cam is going to place down for this round. What, are those platypus? I don't even think that's a water mob. They look really silly, though. And to be honest, I don't even think these mobs do damage either. I think that's three rounds that Cam has placed down mobs that don't do damage. I think I'm going to pick another really overpowered mob for this round because Cam just keeps picking stupid mobs. So if we go to our creative menu, we can just type in hammer and oh, there's two. I think I'm going to go with this hammerhead shark and just place it down and see what it looks like. Look, it's got a hammerhead. And sharks are super dangerous, so I'm gonna place down a, a bunch of them. And hopefully this army of hammerhead sharks will be more than enough for Cam's platypus army. And it looks like Cam is building like a blue platypus. Is he supposed to be building Perry from Phineas and Ferb? Okay, well, I think I'm going to go invisible and go blow up that statue because who doesn't love messing with Cam? So if I just grab a potion of invisibility and drink it, there we go. I am gone. Now we just need TNT, a flint and steel, and some sand. Because you can't blow up TNT underwater, I need to do something special with the sand. So if we just go on over to Cam's side, I am still invisible so he can't see me. And we could just look at this stupid statue that he's building. I am going to blow this up. So if we just come around to the back where Cam can't see, I'm going to place down the TNT and put the sand on top of it and blow it up. Wait, what's that sound? No, my Perry the Platypus statue! How is it blown up? It's underwater! How can somebody do that? There's no underwater TNT. All right, now we're gonna come to the front and we're gonna do it again and blow up the beak. Wait, no! His face! Why? And I think that's enough trolling for this round. His entire statue is blown up and he has no idea how. So let's just go back over to my side. I also need to drink some milk to get rid of the invisibility. That way I don't forget like I did in round two. And I think that time is up. My entire army of hammerhead sharks is ready to fight the platypus army. So Cam, are you ready for round four? Yeah, I'm ready, but somebody blew up my building. That, how do they blow it up if it's underwater? I don't know. Somebody must have like done some like hack stuff and cheated to spawn in some TNT that can blow up underwater, but I think I'm ready. My army is going to completely annihilate yours, and are you ready? Yes, I am ready, but I wouldn't be so sure about your army winning because my army is probably better than yours. I wouldn't be so sure about that. Well, let me just get rid of the wall and we can get ready for round four in three, two, one. Here is my hammerhead shark army, and they are going to completely destroy your platypuses. Oh my gosh, they look super scary. Look, my hammerhead sharks are attacking your platypus. Well, they're also getting poisoned because platypus are poisonous. And this is hilarious. Let's go. Wait, platypus are poisonous? I don't think they are because my sharks are completely fine. Oh, look, one of your sharks just died. Look, there's its tooth. I don't think they're dying. I think they just lose teeth whenever they bite things. No, 
oh i i promise one of your sharks is dead and look my platypuses are trying to win but there's so many sharks well maybe you should have just spawned in more platypuses look that shark just completely destroyed that platypus came your army isn't even trying there's these two up here that are just relaxing well I think they need to get inside. They're just sleeping to recover with it. We need to push them in. Get back in the battle. You don't get breaks. Wait, Nick. What? Why is there a, is this a glitch block? Why is there glass here? I, I think that's just a server bug. You see how laggy the sharks are? I think the server is just lagging. Oh, all right. I guess I won't mind it then, but I, I'm down to my last few platypuses and I don't think I'm gonna win, but I think I could still kill a few more of your sharks. And no, they just took out one of my platypuses. This is so embarrassing. I only have two left. Come on, you got this guys. No, I only have one more. This is the last platypus right here. And to be honest, I don't think the platypus is going to do anything because that shark just completely destroyed it. That has to be rigged. All right, let's clean up the arena and we will start the final round where I'm definitely going to win. You're not going to win. I can't believe that Cam saw this one way glass right here. I need to fix it just by doing that. That way he doesn't know that I'm actually cheating. And let's just repair the arena and get ready for round five. Okay, and now it is time for the fifth and final round. Hopefully Cam actually has a good mob this time because to be honest i want a challenge he's had like a bunch of mobs that do no damage so hopefully for this round he picks something good so let's just look through the one-way glass and see what he places down for round five. Oh my gosh are those alligators alligators are super strong and super scary and look there's even baby alligators well i think i'm gonna have to pick a super strong mob in order to defeat those because alligators are super strong if we open up the creative inventory we can just look up shark and we grab a tiger shark a tiger and a shark are both super strong so this mob has to be too so if we just place down a bunch of these and look they look super scary hopefully the crocodiles will be no match for the tiger shark so I'm just going to place down an entire army of them. And look, my tiger sharks are already ready to start killing those crocodiles. But I think I want to go over to campsite and get rid of some of those because they're actually really scary and I don't want to lose this round. So let me just grab another invisibility potion because I don't want Cam to see me and I don't want him to know that I'm cheating. And then we just fly over to his side and look, these crocodiles are trying to cheat. They're trying to get to my side. Get out of here. There's no cheating. Well, except for me. Then we could just use this mob killer and one hit them. So go away, go away. And oh, I don't think Cam saw that. We could just take out a few more while Cam's not looking. And there we go. I think that is enough. Wait, what happened to most of my crocodiles? I only have a few left and there's scales on the ground. Uh, Cam, are you sure that crocodiles are a water mob? Maybe they drowned. No, they're a water mob. Alligators aren't the water mob. I think they're killing them through the wall. I don't know. I wouldn't be so sure, but spawn some more while you still have time. All right, I spawned in a couple more and I think you should go ahead and drop the wall for round five and I... I'm definitely gonna win this. All right, I cannot forget to get rid of my invisibility. That way Cam doesn't know that I went over to his side. So let me just drink this milk. And it is time for round five. Cam, are you ready for me to drop the wall? I am so ready. Hurry, hurry, hurry. All right, let me just replace it with air in three, two, one. Here we go, my army of tiger sharks. And look, my tiger sharks are going after your crocodiles. Oh my gosh, this has to be rigged. They're so strong. Oh, look, they're attacking back. Yeah, but no. the crocodiles are no match for the tiger shark. Yes, I got rid of one tiger shark. Yeah, you got rid of one. But look, that's your last one gone. Oh my gosh, this has to be rigged. Uh, well, it's a combination of a tiger and a shark. So really, what did you expect, Cam? I don't know, but we should clean up the arena so we can do the outro. Yep, let's get ready for the outro. All right, Cam, come on down to my side so we can film this outro. All right, I'm coming. If you enjoyed this video, then make sure to subscribe because there is a bunch more videos like this on the way where I definitely beat Cam in every single mob battle. Wait, Nick! What? Were you cheating? Why is your side glass and my side bedrock? I think the server's bugging because this was bedrock the entire time. No, look, it's one-way glass. You cheated. I win. I win. I win. I didn't cheat. You don't win. I definitely win. Look, you cheated. Look, this side is bedrock and this side is glass. I definitely win. Whatever. I'll give you the win this time. But be sure to subscribe if you want to see more videos like this because we are going to try to post a bunch. And I'm definitely going to win without Nick cheating. No, you're not. But we'll see you later. Bye. Bye.